Hello and a very warm welcome. Guang Yu Zhou is an Alfa Romeo driver. It has been leaked that he is an Alfa Romeo driver. Some Alfa Romeo dealership has leaked it, saying Go Guang Yu Zhou, as he is an Alfa Romeo driver. This will be officially announced on Tuesday the 16th, but it's basically confirmed as it has been leaked, and Guang Yu Zhou will be the first Chinese driver in Formula One. And Guang Yu Zhou, we just had confirmation and extension of the Shanghai Grand Prix, and this is fantastic news for China as a country, as Guang Yu Zhou is an Alfa Romeo driver. We know there's been tension between Juvenazzi, bad strategies, angry radio. Alfa Romeo's dealer blunder as Guang Yu Zhou announcement already in the window. Guang Yu Zhou is an Alfa Romeo driver for 2022. An Alfa Romeo dealer in China put up a sign uh, a bit too early and it's been leaked. Um, it's no secret that Guang Yu Zhou was favourite. Now, for people who say we talk nonsense, we did get Kimi Raikkonen, right, Bottas, Russell, Albon. Of course, the main target for Alfa Romeo was De Vries. That's gone quiet. And now it's between Oscar Piastri and Guang Yu Zhou. But Guang Yu Zhou has got the seat. Now, it's going to be very harsh on Piastri as he does lead the F2 title as we speak. And Guang Yu Zhou is second. Yeah, it's fantastic news really for Formula 1 as Guang Yu Zhou will be the first Chinese driver to race in Formula 1 and they've just extended the deal at the circuit. There's a lot of passion in China for Formula 1. Of course, we've not been there for a long time with the pandemic. During the first free practice at Brazil, a message came out with a picture of an Alfa Room alpha dealer in china the dealer already had a poster of joe in the window congratulations to joe the first chinese driver in formula one a blunder by the dealer and of course not nice for alpha as they've not confirmed the news yet so we got a picture alpha romeo alpha romeo is already showing guan yu joe in china dealerships of course um again i always say the f2 champion should be getting a seat if that champion is piastri then he should be given an opportunity but he's not going to be so that let's not beat around the bush now guang yu Zhou brings a huge sponsorship and that is why he's getting a seat now i don't like this route of sponsorship mazapin is on the grid due to money joe's on the grid due to money and China and that whole uh, like background it's good to have a Chinese driver Chinese Grand Prix uh, you've got Latifi you've got Stroll but Stroll has actually proved himself so yeah this is breaking news Guang Yu Zhou is an Alfa Romeo driver it will not be confirmed till Tuesday the 16th but take it with a pinch of salt because we we when the driver market was happening, we said Kimi had retire. It happened. Bottas to Alpha, Russell to Merck, Albon to Williams. We got them all right. And yeah, I have a source. The source posted late last night. And yeah, I'm reacting this morning. Guang Yu Zhou is official. He will be an Alpha Romeo driver for 2022. He will partner Valtteri Bottas. Uh, for 2022 and yeah comment down below your thoughts i would love to know expect the announcement on tuesday but we're doing it on saturday as i'm pretty co like my source that i use i am i like trust it 99.9 percent .9%, so yeah harsh on nick de Vries, harsh on oscar piastri but guang yu joe is an alfa romeo driver he brings a lot of sponsorship, 25 million, and I've heard 35 million, so it's a no-brainer. And Alfa Romeo uh, 
they're going to be beat by Williams in the Constructors this season. So they're going to finish ninth. That's not great. And I do feel sorry for Giovinazzi. Uh, bad strategies. I think Giovinazzi has been better than Kimi in quali. But the problem is Giovinazzi is his races. Is, like his races are not strong enough. And obviously that's a massive strength of Kimi. So the Alfa Romeo 2022 lineup will be Guan Yu Zhou and Valtteri Bottas. Comment down below. I expect this news to break on Tuesday, the 16th.